welcome back to our vlog for today's video we were gonna show you how to make a scutum system well english let's start please watch until the end so ngayon ay gagawa tayo ng skeletal system at idodrawing lang natin sila ng isa-isa para mamaya isisimbol natin ang mga skeleton bones na i-drawing natin. So, natapos ko na na-drawing lahat pero hindi ko na na-videohan kasi nalabat yung cellphone. Yan. Nilagyan ko yun ng pentel pen para mas makapal at Nilaglian ko na din ng cardboard para matigas. So, ipapakita ko sa inyo yung mga bagay na ginagamit ko sa pagsimbol ng skeleton. Una, gumagamit tayo ng round fastener at gagamit din tayo ng puncher pambutas ng skeleton bones na ginawa natin. At meron na rin pala ako natapos ng skeleton part pero hindi ko muna tinapos kasi Pivijohan ko pa. Tatapusin na natin. Tapos na natin lahat ng skeleton system bone part. Ayan. So, i-explain na natin to yung parts of skeleton mamaya. So, now I will describe or explain to you the parts of the skeletal system. Let's start with the structure one, which is the cranium. Common words called, but you need to use cranium there. Mandible, which the jaw there. Skull, all together, the mandible and the cranium all together make up a skull. Clavicle, which is your collarbone. The pectoral girdle, which is to compose of entire shoulder area. The scapula, which is the bone back at your shoulder. The sternum, which connect rib cage down middle of your chest. The ribs. The humerus, which is your upper arm. The spine which of course supports your spinal cord. Next, the vertebra, the individual bone that makes up your spine. The pectoral girdle, which decomposes of entire shoulder area, which includes the pelvis. And I will skip here and go to the lower arm bones, which is the thumb side in your radius and in your pinky side is your ulna let's finish out the bones out in hand here we have the carpals which is your wrist part 
We have a metacarpal jaw to your first set of bones leading up to your fingers. And then we have the phalanges, which is your finger itself. Your thigh bone is called a femur. Your kneecap is called a patella. The big bone in your lower leg is called a tibia. And the smaller bone in your lower leg is called the fibula. We have the tarsals. Notice the connection there between the hand and the foot carpals for the tarsals for foot, which will be the bone ankle. And then the metatarsals, which will be in your foot itself that lead to your toes, which will be the phalanges. Okay, and then I'm done explaining the parts of skeletal system. Hope you enjoy. Give it to me like. <laughs>